So I got asked the other day, hey Tommy, I've got one of these uh, connect up to your hose spray bottles uh, and I got extra fluid in there. Can I put it into a, a spot sprayer and uh, use it? Or do I just have to use it as it shows right here on the end of a hose? Well, here's an example of a pump up one gallon sprayer, which is kind of useful to spot spray weeds or other things. So it's a good question. So this particular sprayer is 32 ounces. Now let's see how many square feet it was supposed to cover. So when I look on the back here, it says 16,000. But let's look at the fine print. So you can see that 16,000 was if you had a southern lawn. But if you have a northern lawn like me, this is really set up for 8,000 square feet. So with a little bit of math, we can figure out how many ounces are supposed to be delivered over that 8,000 square feet. The next question would be, how many gallons were delivered over that 8,000 square feet with this sprayer so we know how much water to add to our can sprayer, our pump sprayer, for every ounce that we're going to put in from this container. So I decided the smartest thing to do would be to take that head off of the Weed Be Gone bottle, uh, shorten up the pickup tube a little bit and fit it into one of these 32 ounce Chapin jars and that way I'll have a good reading on the side of how many ounces are coming out. Uh, I put some red food coloring in with some water and so now I'm just going to take a reading on the meter to see what our starting uh, gallon level is and then we'll get to spraying. Alright, I got it all set. Got our 32 ounces in there, got the sprayer all set. Hose is good to go. I'm going to let her run. Close enough, cutting her off. Alright, here's how many gallons we had afterwards. 